Hey everybody, it's Bolt Matrix, and today is February 1st, 2023. After Giant Robot News yesterday, we've got even more Giant Robot News. Got some Rise of the Beast information and got some Earthspark information for you. So let's go ahead and get into it. First up, we've got Transformers Earthspark Season 2 confirmed, and the next part of Season 1 is going to start airing on March 3rd, 2023. I'm a little bit confused because I, even though I I've read this article a couple of times. I'm not sure if we're getting the entire rest of the season or just eight additional episodes. So let's see. Paramount has officially dropped the trailer for Transformers or Sparks Season 1 Part 2. We'll talk about this in a second. The series will continue with streaming of 26 episodes Season 1, which 10 have aired so far on March 3rd. An additional eight episodes will be made available then. Okay, so I read that as saying there are going to be eight episodes in this next batch. So that'll get us up to episode 18, and then a few months later, I'm assuming there'll be the last eight episodes. So, okay, fine. It's going to be on Paramount Plus and uh, your favorite pirate site. Yar. Now to start with, we've got the or two of the three new Terran bots showing up in their pseudo transforming modes. We've got the little blue one who appears to be a car. No idea what the purple one is yet. We've got our first in action shot of Starscream. And we got Bumblebee in his original form. <laughs> and then we got, well, that was a stunticon. That was a breakdown. And I don't care what anybody says. We are getting freaking Transmetal 2 or Transmetal Tarantulas. He's going to be an Earthspark. Oh my god. And here's Snarling Starscream. I like the head sculpt. I think it's a neat evolution of the head sculpt. And hello, Shockwave. You're looking rather fine today. And this is Megatron and Shockwave talking. Megatron is pretty much saying it doesn't have to be this way. And I swear where they are going and arguing over what looks to be a comic book. I realize that's the all spark, but this angle makes it look like some kind of weird comic book. And Grimlock is here, because of course he is. Not totally loving the redesign, but it overall works. It's fine. And that was pretty much it. All the stuff at the preview that I wanted to show you, or the trailer, I should say. Yeah, new episodes, March 3rd. Yes, please. This show is one of my favorite things from last year transformers wise it was just such a happy surprise and i'm hoping we get some good toys out of it next up we've got a transformers rise of the beast two and one optimus prime blaster and masks so this is a toy of optimus prime that turns into a blaster i mean obviously and then we're and then the masks of bumblebee and primal so the two and one blaster uh, it's going to be $19.99, and the masks are going to retail for $35 a pop. So that's actually pretty expensive. I'm not too... I don't know. I'm just not feeling the blaster. It kind of reminds me of the pen from a couple of years ago, that, but worse. But then the masks... I'm not going to get the Bumblebee one. I don't like the look of that, but I'm definitely getting that Primal one. And Gav, if you're watching, you've got another thing for the monkey shelf. And then there's the pound and transform prime i actually saw this in target uh last week so i i almost bought it but i, I just couldn't part with 40 bucks for this all it does is turn into that i'm not saying it's bad or broken or dumb or anything it's for kids but it just wasn't doing it for me next up rise of the beasts die cast series and i'm kind of looking forward to this. this this is pretty cool i am a car guy so I am looking forward to this. We got a 132 Chevrolet Camaro Bumblebee, a 132 Optimus Prime, a 132 Volkswagen Bus Wheeljack, a 124 1977 Chevy Camaro, a 124 Optimus Prime, a 124 Volkswagen Bus Wheeljack, and a 116 Chevy Camaro RC car. Interesting. I don't know. Actually, you know what? No, I will probably get this for my son. I bet he would love this thing. But then we've got the actual, man, that is not a very good, that is not a very good image. That thing did not load very well. But the Chevy Camaro, and then we got Prime. I love the look of that Prime. And we got Wheeljack, and then we got the smaller ones. Actually, no, these might be just the same ones. Yeah, I, I think these are kind of neat. I kind of like these. I really love the Volkswagen bus, though. 
and Prime. I mean, I, I mean, I just love the Prime one. I, I might get these for my uh, for my car shelf. Good lord, I've got like how many how many Prime and Bumblebee figures am I going to end up with with this line? Jeez. And the reason I ask that question is because new figures were revealed. Rise of the Beast kids line revealed. Now this all comes from Hasbro via IGN. And there's there's a bunch here. We've got Beast Mode Bumblebee, Beast Alliance Changers Assortment, Beast Alliance Beast Weaponizer 2 Packs, Beast Alliance Beast Combiners Assortment, Beast Battle Masters Assortment, Beast Smash Changers Assortment. Good lord. Alright, let's talk about some, you know, actual toys here. Alright. So this is Beast Mode Bumblebee. It's Bumblebee that transforms into his souped up car mode and then has this weird bird mode addition. That's just so weird. It's like Bumblebee gets wings and it, does he combine with Air Razor to get like an Energon sword? It's so strange. And now we've got the com I don't know what line this is. I'm not sure what size class this is. These are figures that were reviewed by some folks last year, I believe. Here's Prime. I love the look of that Prime. So we're obviously getting a different alt mode for Prime this movie. It's more of that military truck. And that little figure is kind of cool looking. I might get that. I, I legitimately like the look of that. And then we got Rhinox. That's a pretty good-looking Rhinox. Both forms. I like that Rhinox. Oh, and he's got the chain gun. I didn't notice that before. That's great. Yeah, that 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 could be a pretty cool little toy. And then another Bumblebee. Hey, Bumblebee, how you doing? <clears throat> now this is the weapon. Com now this is the next series of figures. We got Prime and Primal. So Primal, this is the figure we saw last year that's got the Primal and then the Tigatron or Tiger that transforms into, I guess it's supposed to be a crossbow gun. I'm going to get this one. I really like the look of that Primal. And then Prime, I'm not feeling the Prime, but I love the little wolf. It turns into a chainsaw. You fold the wolf in, ha in half and a chainsaw sticks out his butt. I, I like that. I'm probably going to get this one anyway, just because I I think it's a little doofy, but I'm more interested in the Primal, which I'm surprised they're not showing pictures of Primal's Beast Mode. Now, these are the Beast Combiners. These are weird. There's Bumblebee. He's got his little Camaro form. He's got a little alt or robot mode that looks like Commander size or Commander class size. And then it has a wolf that drops onto his head. And then we have RC, which that, that vehicle mode works... <laughs> That alt mode look, still looks better than RC and Road Rocket in Legacy. Good God. And then she's got a wolf that she combines with to make whatever the hell that is supposed to be. I actually kind of like it. It reminds me of uh, Transformers Energon. And then we've got Primal, who that, that's actually a pretty okay Primal figure, and a Gator. Oh, that's that's just perfect. That's perfect. That's a nod back to the original Megatron figure in Beast Wars. And then the gator flops onto him and he gets a tail thing. And then there's a gun hanging off the side. <laughs> I, I like these. These are so stupid. And then we've got these little beasties. We've got a cheetah that transforms into a sword. And then we have a rhinox that transforms into an ass cannon. Oh, my God. They, they did it. They actually did it. He's a a a, a sh what? What did Grimlockimus say? Instead of a Gatling gun, a Shatling gun. Yes, a Shatling gun. I I have to get I have to get this Rhinox. This is this is so stupid. I absolutely have to have this. Oh my god! And then we have a Gator that transforms into a cannon. I like that. If you have an Action Master croc this would be a great new action master croc accessory <laughs> oh oh my god that that's the, the, the shadowing gun jeez 
All right, folks, let me know what you think of all this down in the comments. Please be sure to remember these are all for kids. These are supposed to be for kids, but good God, the prices on some of these, like, I'm not sure the, the kids are going to, or their parents are going to be able to afford all of these. Will I get all of them? I'm going to get some of them because some of them I actually do like. I like the idea, especially the Rhinox figure. Hey Hasbro, please make sure we have a Voyager or a Deluxe Class Rhinox for ROTB. I really want to see what that figure is going to look like. All right, folks, let me know what you think of all this down in the comments. I've been Ball Matrix. I'll catch you all next time.